Do you, if you even knew how giddy I was, I actually, Stephanie is back. How are you, Steph? Hey, good, to, good see you. to see you. I caught her in the makeup room the other day, and I wasn't even selling this. I'm like, where's that grill? I want that grill. I need that grill. <laughs> it's $100 off for this show. This is the final airing at birthday. It is the final chance at that birthday price. It's the final chance with free shipping for less than $50. Do you know my makeup artist, Kristen, owns this? Yes. I want to get this. Everybody here at this network has been buzzing about this grill since it debuted at HSN. And the reason is, have you ever seen anything yeah. quite like this? This is Philips infrared smokeless grill. I mean, how cool is this? <laughs> it is glowing like a red spaceship on your counter. But it's what it does that makes it even cooler. So you oh, can grill man. absolutely anything that you would normally go outside in the rain with the bugs, where it's 110, where bad things happen, your food falls in the fire, you swear. It's not a fun thing when you're grilling outside and it's not a flawless process. Yeah. Grilling here is flawless each and every time. It is. Hey, staff, I just want everybody to see that quantity left. I have begged. We have 600 and 600 only, and this is it. This is your final shot. Before we take away that birthday prize, oh, I got to tell you, that's better than my grill. You it know is. what? It is better than I'm your serious. grill. And I'll tell you why, and you'll start to understand it with the technology. Yeah. There are no flare-ups. There are All no right. hot spots. So everything is cooked exactly evenly. This makes me look like such an amazing You're the grill meister. Cook. I am. I have got it under control. But only when it's done on my countertop and with this infrared technology. For real. Let's talk a minute about the technology because that I think will help you understand why this is so unique and why it works perfectly perfectly every single time. So inside our grill is infrared heating. And yeah. the way Philips has this designed is that the infrared heat shoots up and around the food. And oh. that is creating an even heating platform. Oh. First of all, do you see me waving my hands over yeah. this? Okay, you can't do that over a regular grill. And if you do, it's you're gonna get burned. So right. obviously it's not a good choice. Right. So here's the way the infrared heating is working. It is shooting up the heat so that the grate of the grill, the surface of the grill, is an even 450 degrees oh, wow. at every corner. That is the temperature that Philips and Grill Meisters have determined. That gives you the perfect sear and caramelization on your food. So every corner is exactly the same temperature. There's no flare-ups, there's no fire. None no. of that is gonna charge your food but here's the key here's yeah. the smokeless part see how your grease and your fat and that's normal your juice sure. drips off your food sure, sure, sure. when it lands on the tray the tray is cool as a result oh. no splatter no smoke and with things like fish also no oh, smoke. you can do fish on this fish is this specialty this is my number one thing I cook here but no I would odor. never do that on my outdoor grill never no, right you wouldn't do it on your outdoor ever. grill because you would be ruining your fish because it would be getting stuck to of your course. grill yeah. and a lot of people don't want to do this in inside on any sort of grill right. because of the smell. Yeah, it's but true. what makes smell? Smoke. Oh, you're so right. we have no you're smoke. Right. We have no smell. And look at asparagus. This is where Philips uh. makes me so happy. They think about everything that doesn't work with traditional grilling and solve the problem. Asparagus do not work on an, most outdoor oh, grills no, absolutely because the, not. the space of the grate is too right. far apart. Okay, I'll just tell you, we have every service representative taking phone calls. I, I, I feel like I'm a crusader for this product and I've never even gotten to air it with Stephanie before. If first of all, Philips is a leader in culinary technology. They're a leader in technology, period. We have the lowest price in America. I will tell you, if you want to spend a hundred dollars more, go to that other website, go to that other internet, go to the, you know, go somewhere else. They're gonna charge you a hundred dollars more. And you know, the thing is, whether you whether you don't like the heat like me, I love grilled food, but I'm afraid of the grill. I don't like the charcoal, I don't like the coals, I don't like the propane. I'm not, you know, but I love grilled food now suddenly we're putting grilled food back on the menu whether it's rainy whether Absolutely. it's cloudy whether it's snowing whether it's 150 degrees outside and stephanie the best thing about this is though you get better results than if you were going outside. Exactly, and I know there are purists out there sure. and you're thinking, I am not giving up my outdoor grill. And you know what, I'd say don't give it up, but just know yeah. that there's always the risk that the steak that you're cooking decides to you know, lay right. out a big pile of juice and all of a sudden, right. whoosh, you have a charred yeah. edge. No flare-ups. There are no flare-ups here. None. Everything I put on here is picture perfect yeah. every single time. You know one thing that you said, Stephanie, that really kind of resonated with 
with me though, there are no hot and cold spots. You know, when you grill outside, you know how you have to put that one wiener on the back shelf and you gotta put the one hot dog oh, on right. the other one? Then you gotta and move them around you gotta, the fire Who wants to just, rotate your wieners? I don't have time I mean, for that. <laughs> yeah, who has time? So now it is perfect precision temperature control. Exactly. And so that means you're going to get precise and perfect results. I don't care if it's fish or if it's grilled vegetables or if it's kebabs, if it's Joey Fatone's best hot dogs in the exactly. world. Exactly, we're gonna go there. I mean, and hey, by the way, if you're a fan like I am, please call us. That testimonial talk line is open. Part of the reason I don't own this yet is Stephanie has sold this out every single time that it has been on the network. I, I do a lot of the cooking shows here at HSN. I've never even gotten to air this, and you don't even know how excited I was. I, I actually, no kidding, when, when Stephanie and I were talking about the air fryer earlier this week, I told her I want to make this my host pick, and I've never even aired it. I am such a huge fan, and believe you me, Stephanie, I feel like I've kind of road tested most of the kitchen items that we sell here absolutely at HSN. Have. For me to say, this is something that I absolutely want to add to my repertoire, it's a big deal because, you know, the thing is, we've got other grills, you know, we sell other outdoor grills, other indoor grills. We don't have anything that does what Phillips does. And quite honestly, there is nothing else like this on nope. the market. This is unique. The infrared technology is the latest and greatest. And oh, now what is, okay, what, say, what is waiting. going on there? What do you think that could be? Hmm. Mm, that would be grilled cheese wrapped oh, in bacon. Oh, now, everybody keeps saying why, and the answer is because we can. Because you can. Because we can. But there's actually two really good cooking points here I want to show you. Okay. First of all, bacon done on a grill is oh, heavenly yeah, with bet. the crispy texture. But I'm anti-bacon because of mess on my stovetop. Oh, yeah, Makes no. me absolutely crazy. I'm with you there. So think about when you're cooking bacon when there's no spatter. Yeah. When the drippings drain down on to a cool surface so there's no smoke. Right. Then there's no old bacon smell right. the rest of the day. Bacon done on this indoor smokeless grill is amazing. And the reason that we've gone ahead and done the melted cheese with it is because that also is showing us how even the heating is. Yeah, I would not right. have this perfect melted cheese in this sandwich if I did not have even you're heating right. all the way across the grill. So it is a combination of a great new way to cook bacon and also a really phenomenal sandwich if right. you're going to be done. Exactly. I do want to point out the pineapple as yeah. well because again, nice. something else that doesn't work real well outside would be the fruits and vegetables. For sure. Everything's just a little too it, delicate. It is. Hey, by the way, you get the meal easy planner as well. You get a great little recipe, an instruction booklet as well. And uh, I do want to point out though, this is it. In fact, the only reason that I, I finally got Stephanie in, in my show with this is because it's in inclement weather. It's rainy outside. Otherwise, we're, we would be outside right now. Uh, but I have to tell you, I feel like a kid in a candy store. We're taking $100 off for this show. We're taking $100 off for this hour. This is your final opportunity at that birthday price. There are 577 of you who can get this. Boy, you hear that sizzle, Stephanie? And you know what? You hear the mm. sizzle and you think, oh, I certainly am grilling right here on my yeah. countertop. But what don't you see? You don't see any smoke. Nope. So you know that I've got juices, and these are marinated shrimp kebabs. Yep. The marinade's draining down. Smokeless means smokeless. You see that is a close shot right there with a high quality camera lens. You are not seeing any smoke. It is the real deal that this will not cause any problems in your kitchen. I do want to show you that it is cool to the touch with the handles on the edge. So if I were to need to grab something down in there, it's no problem to do it. But for me, I can have this literally sitting on my counter on my kitchen island and the kids can be running all around. And even if someone were to bump into the side of it, it is warm to the touch at best. I am hugging a countertop grill that is 450 degrees on its cooking surface, but yet safe to the touch on the outside. So real kudos to Philips for coming up with the safety feature there. Here's another look at the features, and then we're going to talk about some of the uh, details here. It does have the constant heat of 450. The cleanup is out of this world yeah. easy, and I'm going to show you that with my chicken wings. But I do want to show you the two temperature settings, because okay. this is really neat. So right now, when it's glowing spaceship red here, right. we are on high. And there is a button on the side that gives me a high and a low. Okay. When I switch it to low, oh. it's a little bit more of a 
subtle glow. Yeah. That is an even 250 degrees. Oh, nice. What a cool way to keep yeah, food warm. So if I'm say. doing something like kebabs, I'm going to cook them and maybe we're entertaining and we'll right. have some cocktails and there'll yeah. be appetizers. But I can keep it on warm and people can serve themselves oh, Stephanie, I want this. from it. Oh, and you know what else? The infrared technology comes from five star restaurants. That's how they keep your meals warm as they're being assembled. For real. So Phillips just took the top of the line restaurant technology and gave it to us in a form that we can use in our homes. And only for this show. I want to point out again, $49 on your credit card. We'll show you the quantity left. Now we've sold almost a thousand or over a thousand. 500 of you are, we're taking $100 off your price. We are taking $100 off your price for the next 500 and 500 people only. Yes, the least of which you can do are your Joey Fatone uh, fat boy hot dogs. But I have to say, Stephanie, you're going to do something that I would never do on my grill. Okay, yeah, I want to see. You're Ready making me nervous. Mess? I know, I love, I love mess. This is fun. Okay, watch. Okay. That is wing sauce that is going oh. all over. And give Can it, you imagine if somebody did that on your own? It would be grill? an inferno. You, yeah, right. So if you like to cook with sauces, and I do yeah, love my marinades and sauces too. on grilled food, slap it on. Why not? Teriyaki, sugar, the yeah. more the merrier. So, okay, now I've made a pretty good mess here. Right. I do want to show you that as I take them off, look at okay. the non-stick of that grate. Oh, that's crazy. I mean, isn't that amazing? That's why my salmon isn't sticking. Ooh, that hot smell so good. Honestly, doesn't that hot smell yeah. so great? I have done a flaky white fish like a tilapia on this. There yeah. is no problem. So Phillips made the spacing of these perfect for smaller items. Then they made it so that the nonstick makes my food so easy to cook. Nothing That's that we'd ever awesome. deal with. And then here's the best part of all. What's the other horrible thing about having a grill? <laughs> Clean up. Clean up. All right, watch yeah. this. Wet rag. Okay. Here we go. That's it. That nonstick on both nutty. sides. So... I have absolutely no concerns. I mean, that's it. You that's can throw crazy. it in the dishwasher, but you don't even need to. Do you to. know what's so funny? Even with pouring that hot sauce on there, it's still minimal smoke that yeah, came up from it, that. Right when it hit, we right. had the residual, and now we're yeah. done. And, and that's it. Done. And now it's just sitting there. Here's the stay cool tray. Again, I've got 450 degrees right here, right. but I am able to grab this silver tray with my hand because that is how I'm not getting smoke. Right. And do you see how it's not all burned on and no. stuck and nasty? Because it's cool down yeah. there. Think of the mess if I had to scrape it every single time. But you know what? And it's, I, I know Stephanie pointed this out earlier. It's it's safe to put on your countertop. It's safe to put, you know, on your uh, buffet. Absolutely. So whether we're talking tailgating, whether we're talking assisted living, whether we're just talking, it now now suddenly grilling season is 12 months out of the year. And, and I'm and so glad you pointed that because, out. Because, you know, I'm from Minnesota and it's kind of like most things. You buy the jet ski and you can use it for like a week, right? Exactly. You know? Well, you know, in the grill, I mean, think about it. Even yeah. in a climate like Florida, where you do have more months of the year, it's raining, it's buggy, yep. it's hot. Now the weather doesn't matter. Now the conditions don't matter. Now the time of day doesn't it's matter. True. Grilled breakfast is uh. my new special treat. So if you have never experienced French toast grilled, Ooh. it is amazing. Oh, I'm going to have to do that. It puts a great crisp and crunch on it. And would you ever haul yourself outside to <laughs> grill breakfast no for way. your friends or family? I barely get breakfast on the table <laughs> Right. I mean, seriously. So the fact that we can now enjoy the grill factor, it's just something oh, new and different man. to do. But like so many of our Philips products, once you get this home and you start to use it, and then you think, ooh, maybe yeah. I should try this. Ooh, I maybe I should try that. And suddenly you realize there is not a single meal that you can't make yeah. right there on your countertop. Fresh, healthy, grilled food. I have not put a single bit nope. of oil nope. on anything nope. I am cooking. So I know I'm making great choices as I make it. Yeah. And again, most importantly, if the quality of the food wasn't as good as outdoor, I wouldn't want to keep you doing do it. it. But you are never going to know the nope. difference. And it's because of this infrared. This is really the key. It's the key to the technology, why it works so well. But also, the heat is there because yeah. you have to have it hot enough <laughs> right? to get the sear, to get the caramelization, yeah. to get the reasons you love grilled food. Well, the way this infrared reflects up, oh, the heat is there. So you've got the results. You've seen the steaks. We're going to show you the burgers. You're 
getting the results. What makes it doable inside your kitchen, inside your home, is the cool tray on the bottom. So yeah. that everything that is dripping down, the fat off the burgers, the cheese, the sauces, right? none of it is causing any smoke. Nope. So these are pretty fatty burgers. Yeah. burgers. These are 80-20. I think it's yeah. Chuck. So we're making a pretty good mess down here. Yeah. But I do not have any kind of exorbitant smoke no. at and all. And you know what? So yeah, you, we are a nation that loves to grill, and it's a healthier way to cook. Good choice. But now, you, it's it's all everything that you love with nothing that you don't love, meaning you don't have the cleanup, you don't have the bugs, you don't have the heat, you don't have the weight, you don't have the hot and cold spots or the mess. And that's what's so brilliant about this. Even on my, I've got a pretty expensive outdoor grill. I'll tell you what, you still have to rotate everything, you know, on those different you layers. It do. still doesn't have even cleanup. The fact that you can do that just freaks me out. And, and think about it. This is hot. This is still on 450 yeah. degrees. I've got stay cool here and the heat is contained down below and yep. reflected back up so that I can work right so on this while smart. it is on. So there's the cleanup. And by the way, the setup, equally easy. Yeah. I asked my husband one time to put together a traditional grill. <laughs> yes. It involved a lot of extra screws and a lot of screaming. And there were some bad words as well. There were some, there bad, were some bad, words. bad words. So now all you do is this will come to your home. Yeah. You will take it out. You will put it on the counter and you will plug it in. And off yeah. you go. And off you go. But here's the thing. Off these go. So I know you can see that the, the, we have seven minutes for sellout. We have 500 and 500 only. We are taking $100 off your purchase. $100 off your purchase until 12 midnight or as long as supplies last. And there you can see that even grilling. And you know, the thing about this is too, Stephanie, like you said, it's the perfect, you know, infrared heat. But because of that, it locks in the moisture. You won't find that things dry out. And you know very well, you know, a dry burger doesn't do anybody any good. I mean, you probably wouldn't even do fish on this, but dry fish, you know, what's the point? Even if you're doing Joey Fatone's hot dogs that are coming up, I mean, these fat one hot dogs, I, I might have to dig into one of these. I'm telling you, <laughs> I have been She tempted. can't wait for her fat one. I know. Look at this. Okay. Oh, rock one. Yeah. You're taking mm. my preview. She's oh. got the preview. So we're talking capacity there in case you wondered why I have so many of those stacked on there. <laughs> <laughs> the grill can handle close to two dozen hot dogs. I just took off six half pound burgers. We've got four fat ones and a <laughs> fair amount of what's, small ones on the exactly side. Exactly, what's remaining? Exactly. Okay, now talk about what you're doing here, Steph. I'll tell you what I'm doing. I'm mm. pouring off and making a pretty good mess doing it. All the grease and fat that cooked off of those burgers. Oh, wow. So again, if I were to do this on the stovetop, you're reabsorbing that. Here's yeah. sobering fact to me. If I do this on a traditional grill, all of this went down oh, yeah. into my grill. So no wonder there's such right. a mess to clean. No wonder you oh, have flare yeah. ups and things that you can't control while you cook. That is a big mess. That's crazy. All of that just drained right off of there. Okay. We wiped this clear and we are good That's to nuts. go. That's nuts. I do have to forewarn you. Unless you are calling now, you won't get it. So forgive that there's a little bite out of one and of the There dogs. would be a chew hot dog <laughs> as part of my display. Why don't we just kind of tuck that exactly. back there and not scare the nice people? <laughs> It's like, and I don't oh even know what Lord. I'm supposed to do with this. Do you know that's a half pound? That is a half that's pound. That's a half pound hot dog. All right. All right. Getting okay. started either. You go back to the one you already right, bit. Okay. Here. I do love the hot dog look, though, because oh, check man. this out. Look at how even it is. Have mm. you ever seen a hot dog that does not have one single black spot on it? No char marks. Again, it's almost oh, wow. like the rotisserie style ones where they oh, go yeah. around and around and around, except you don't have to. It is perfectly marked. I love the fact that every single one of these I make is more pretty than the next one. Can and I tell you though, the food is amazing. There's something about a grill, but like you said too, Stephanie, you don't get the flare ups, you don't get the smoke, you don't better. get the, it's better. It's better. It's you know? better. And I, I do. I'm just going to say it. It's better than my outdoor grill. That's the way I feel. It is. I have never been great at outdoor grilling. In fact, if anything, it has always made me feel like a little bit of a less than successful cook. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm just, it's a lot to maintain. And you know, mm. for me, I usually have side dishes going and kids and dogs running around and it's oh, just yeah. hard to go in and out and work with the grill. And if I'm entertaining, I don't want to be out there. I want to be with everybody. So you know what? You could plug this in outside by the pool if you want to have the outdoor experience. Oh, absolutely. I've had a lot of people talk about using it for tailgating I, I, coming tailgating up with football great. games. I know. Wouldn't this be amazing but to you, be able to serve burgers I like mean, this? I mean, honestly, you take it to the picnic shelter. You take yep. it to the ballpark. Go you take it. it tailgating. You take it for the RV. Now, here's the problem. 
unless you're calling now, uh, and I know you can see that quantity left, we have the final 400, but the one thing about that quantity left, it does not take into account the hundreds of people who are joining us. So if you call me right now, we'll take $100 off. I mean, normally there's that other big, you know, store known for cooking, they're gonna charge you $100 more. They are not gonna give you flex pay. They're not gonna deliver it to your house for free. You're not gonna get a 30 day unconditional money back guarantee. <laughs> if, if you're gonna buy it anywhere, you're gonna buy it here. And if you look at these perfect results, I don't care whether you're doing the fat one hot dogs or if you're doing hamburgers, I love the idea of doing br uh, breakfast on the grill. Just something That's new. That's a good idea. You can yeah. use it over and over and over any mm. way you want to. And each and every time your mm. food is perfectly evenly cooked, each and every time you do not have smoke, I do not smell that I'm cooking shrimp. I do want to check back in on the salmon though because mm. Shannon, I have to tell you, this has become my go-to meal at home because for one thing, I can do it in 10 minutes. My personal effort, more like two minutes. All I have to do is I season mine with a, usually some type of marinade or a sauce and then put it on. Look at how gorgeous oh, this is. Oh my word. Crispy skin on the back side. The perfect oh, amount of yeah. sear on the top side. Do you know what though? If this it's were amazing. in a magazine, I mean, that looks like a cover magazine, but you would never guess that was done on an indoor grill. Absolutely not. Never. You'll pay $25 Never. for this meal in a restaurant. Right. I can do my asparagus on the side because again, my grate is spaced so that nothing is oh, falling down good. in between. And honestly, even if it did, I can grab that with a bare hand and pull it right yeah. back out. And that's Chef crazy. Eric it's showed me this little thing. Look at this. You oh, char yeah. your lemons oh, and then you a get idea. a little extra smoky taste nice. as you juice onto your food. Oh, that's pretty. And this is a gourmet meal that I have made with little to no effort. Right. I'm making great choices in terms of health and the end result is phenomenal. It, it is. I just love it. I, I'm just going to tell you, if you want it, you're going to have to do it now. In fact, the only reason that I don't own this already, Stephanie has sold this out every single time that it has been here at HSN. We've got 300 and 300 only. We have almost as many people calling as we do have quantities remain. We're, we're going to charge you $100 more after this show. It is $100 off what all the other retailers in America are selling this for. Plus, it's got free shipping. Plus, it's on flex pay, and plus, 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 it's everything that you love about grilling without the weight, without the hassle, without the uneven cooking, without the, the crummy cleanup. I mean, it's everything that we love about grilling. And I'm just telling you, you have not lived until you've put, you know, I've, I've got a, I steam hot dogs, you boil hot dogs, boy, you grill hot dogs. Ooh, that'll get you closer to God, honey. Absolutely. <laughs> and it's the only way I think you should eat hot dogs, to I'm be quite honest. Because you. once you've had them any other way, you get the crispy on the outside. I'm a big fan of sausage on oh, the grill, yes, too. Italian sausage on the grill, little kick. Yeah. Some great things there. Corn works just as well. And again, even something a little more yeah. delicate like kebabs. Right. Easy to hold together. It's the nonstick of the grate that is making this work. This is new and innovative. This is one of yeah. those things that when you get it home and you set it up and you're doing something and people come over, they're going to be like, what have you, you got going it. on? Because this is the only so thing cool. out there like this. It, Infrared, it smokeless and everything that comes off it. Absolutely. You know what, Mark? Perfection. I just want to do it. I know we're almost, we're getting ready to sell this out, but if we just do a quick little pan of the food, I, if you closed your eyes, if you didn't watch mm. Stephanie do this live, you go, that didn't come off an indoor grill. Absolutely. I defy you to tell me that salmon did not cut, that we did not do it outside. That steak, look at those beautiful grilled peppers and the chicken. The gr I'm a, such a sucker for grilled oh, vegetables. All those veggies are oh, so yummy. man. Yum, yum. Grilled fruits, stone fruits. That's our grilled bacon cheese. My two favorite food groups, <laughs> right along with Grey Goose. Uh, <laughs> I don't we, grill that. Now, don't that grill that. Bad. Don't grill that. That's for when you're at the grill. Exactly. Okay. But easier to have that while you do this than it's outside. Terrible. Those beautiful smokeless wings, bacon on a grill. We Are did you breakfast. Hitting me. Grilled French toast. We're going to charge you $100 more. I mean, we're taking $100 off. $100 off if you're calling now. Stephanie, I'm a fan. Oh, you will love it. I got to tell you. Well, thank you for coming in to do this for me. Glad I really you got appreciate to see it. it. I, you know, I've been waiting to get mine. I hope, don't, don't let us charge you $100 more. Stephanie, thank you as always. Of course. Uh, and do you know what? You can actually take $40 off that grill as well when you are approved for an HSN card. And basically you've got one more day to qualify for that. So basically if you haven't done the card yet, we absolutely would love to recommend it to you. And of course you can shop on all of these great birthday items. <laughs>
I'm taking, I'm, t I'm taking these. <gasps> these are so good! Thank you. Oh my lord! <laughs> okay, <laughs> normally I bring home my own take home. Joey Fatone in the house! <laughs> whoop, whoop, whoop! <laughs> Good Joey, good Joey, good Joey. Oh, you go got the whole, I love how you have like, the, they're already like made over here for okay. you brought them over, okay. thank well, you. Joey Fatone, you know and love him. In sync, Dancing with the Stars, stage screen, and now the hot dog mice. Can you believe that? Okay, you know what, I have, I have to say, this is it, unless we're going to your restaurant. Right. You can't get these hot dogs no, anywhere. No, that's the beauty. Yeah, that's the thing. Nowhere. I've heard so many requests from people that they say, "Hey, how do we get the hot dog? How do we get? It? How do we yeah. get?" It? I said, "You have to come to Orlando, Florida. That's the first place." But you know what? <laughs> I love how, of course, celebrating 40th anniversary, 40th of HSN. Yeah. And I wanted to do something exciting, something fun. We're giving people hot dogs. We're selling them, obviously here. That's first right. ever. Okay. So. Here's your choice. We got the big fat one. Yes, the fat one. Yeah, they have the they have the fat one, which is is not for the faint of heart. It's eight ounces. Eight ounces. Okay, it's like a half pound hot dog. Yes. No mystery meat. Or beef. Or beef. Or beef. So you know what, Steve? I'll just show him this real quick. Yes. I know Joey's gonna be grilling. Go ahead. No worries. Okay, I'm gonna so I'm gonna make a hot dog. You like ketchup or mustard? We'll keep it plain. Ketchup. Ketchup. Okay. So do right. I. So here's the thing. If you want the half pound hot dogs, the half pound hot dogs, they're like a little slice of heaven. Steve, we have what? Only three. I know. Yep. Yeah, about 300. They love their hot dogs. Okay, so final 300. And then if you want, it's it's actually, you get a, a pack, of four, a four pack. Right? Yep, and it comes 24 in there for, so, the, for the hot dogs. For yep. the hot dogs. And yep. Steve, we have what, 500 only? Okay, 500 only. This is your last shot. Yeah. And honestly, this had to be a labor of love, though, because, I mean, honestly, you've been so successful in yes. every area of your career. Why do a hot dog? Well, uh, it's crazy how it started yeah. out for me. I mean, go ahead and while I say that, you go ahead and eat that, because I do I'm, eat actually a hot dog I'm, with ketchup. I'm, I'm going to So I want, you to, I want you to eat, because obviously you're buying the hot dog, people buying out there. I want you to taste the actual just hot dog, oh, just kind of pretty much as it is. But for me, I always wanted it to have something, whether it be like a, a hot dog joint or a pizza place. And the cool thing for me is I always want to do something and this was it and I went I'm through the tasting you. of the different kind of hot dogs like all the different brands but this one we found of course is 100% beef there's yeah. no fillers uh, there's no MSG in it nope. uh, it's it, it's it's and the beauty part about it is like I said I, I always and the funny part is when people eat hot dogs they yeah. get that repeat effect Oh, yes, no repeating. I made sure that every time that, that we did it, I made sure that we had that no repeat yeah, effect. No repeating. And I'll just None tell you, at all. Yeah. Uh, this, uh, the fat one hot dogs. I'm going to make that for you right now, okay. too, as, as you're talking. Right. Go right ahead. They are a divine experience. <laughs> when I say this is a hot dog, it gets, you, it gets you closer to God, girls. Uh, no kidding. If you are looking for a hot dog that transcends that hot dog experience, right. You know, the thing is, your flavor profile, it's so robust. It's so well-rounded. Well, it's funny that you say that. And really? that's the thing about our, our, our flavor profile for us is what we wanted to do because when you eat a hot dog, yes, you have the salty, salty goodness. Of course, it's always there. And then for me, what I wanted to do is I wanted to bring a little bit more of the sweetness flavor out. That's so what So that's what we did. We kicked it up with a little bit more of a sweetness, and that's why mm. Fat Ones is the way it is. Mm. And I'm making the Fat One right now, which is pretty crazy because we have pepperoni. Okay. We got corned beef. Okay. We also want to put of course the hot dog on there okay. and the reason why so and the other the thing is the only place I can get this at your restaurant the only place you can get this at the restaurant of course if you order now of course you get the hot dog at home and you can make it yourself if you'd like to that's right okay. and the reason why I do this and I butterfly the actual hot dog itself is because once it cooks faster oh yeah that's true and it also is nice because when you put everything on and then you start to can put you like the see french how fries you see that is yeah it's it's yes I it mean, is <laughs> it's moist it's juicy oh, wait, it's I got this gooey first. it's gooey All right, oh, I love it wait then I do this then I put okay. a little bit of the sauce on there just a little bit though I don't want to go too much so on this it. would be the diet plate this is yes this is this is the oh, this is 100 percent the low cal version right what we do and that's the fun thing about like as far as like having stuff at fat ones we do all these different combinations yeah. and stuff and that's what's great about doing these at home when you buy these here and you of course have them at home you can make all the different creations that we have you know I'm and that's the great thing though, about it even from a purist standpoint it just uh, promise me you'll at least try the fat one on its own yes. first because the pr the flavor profile is it's so robust, it's so juicy, it's so well-rounded it, it, before you put anything on it. And then, of course, you can have some fun. You can create your own little fat Well, again, one. yeah, this is, the, this is the fat one. This is what we made over there. This has everything but the kitchen sink in it. <laughs>
<laughs> okay, so you so gonna try to get in that? You gonna try to get in there? So, so it's this corned, corned beef, beef, pepperoni. There's yep. nacho cheese. There's mozzarella cheese, French fries, and a little bit of those uh, lovely green onions. And a whole lot of love. And a whole lot and of love. And a whole lot of love. <laughs> so the thing is, if you want this, if you want the eight count, if you want, you know, <laughs> the half pound hot dogs, right? We have, I think Steve, you said three hundred of them. Pa uh, Yep, okay. Yep, yep. Okay, 300 of them. 300 okay. of them, but they come in, a, right. the big pack, of course, come in a pack of four, these ginormous uh, hot dogs. And the cool thing about the fat ones is you can make it, cut them all up, serve them to your kids. You can probably cut it up four ah. times. It's like, all right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my yeah, it's, lord! Again, not for the fate of heart, but we'll, we'll go down a little smaller though. But we'll make the oh, uh, the Mac good. Daddy, which is fun too. Okay, what's the Mac Daddy? Mac Daddy, of course, hot dog we put on in there, of course. But we also have uh, cheddar, white cheddar mac and cheese. Ooh. We throw that on there, or any mac and cheese will do if you guys want to do that at home. Like I said, you throw it on there. Again, the beauty part about the butterflying is it doesn't fall completely off. Nice. That's something that we we like can to do. I tell do. you, I've been looking forward to this all day. Have you really? I mean, not just working, you know, it. with you, which of right. course I was looking forward to right. it. it goes without saying <laughs> but i'm telling you this is it's like a little piece of hot dog nirvana i'm just gonna keep shoving Ooh. food in your mouth there here have you a are a man one. after my own heart <laughs> i try i hey, try tomorrow's Monday, i try right? i aim to please i aim to please okay now look at this okay so that has yeah bacon on it as well Great. of course would we love the little green onions give a little bit, okay. bit of, a, of a crunch right. and a texture All right, if you will go. i'm going and in. then the mac and cheese i mean you can't, you can't go wrong with that go in for it I'm go in for it go for it look at you going in for it i love it we're happy. And that, like I said, like I said, the exciting oh, thing about this is it has no MSG, no fillers. Oh, I always man. wanted to make sure it was 100% beef. That's that's oh, something for wow. me that was first and foremost. That's the thing. That's what I love about it. Of course, no fillers, no MSG, no soy, no peanuts, no, no tree nuts, no shellfish, no egg white no. products, no wheat, and no added protein. They have no like this mystery, added, nothing. Yes, this milk no protein No mystery, nothing. In fact, nothing. you know what? Can, can I grab, I want to grab, I want to show you one of the packages. Can sure, I go grab them. Yeah, yeah. Okay, you know what? 100%. Okay, because here's what I think is so interesting. It's meat. <laughs> it's just, it's meat. That is what you get. Exactly, you get the meat. You, you don't get, get the, the filler, you don't get the stuff, you don't get the chutney, you don't get the stuff that you can't pronounce, you get meat. Yes. And we, we, we've said that before, actually. If you look at like some of the packages of other hot dogs, yeah. it's got like four or five different, like 80 million lines of like all right. these other things. Exactly. And literally we have like two lines because it's 100% beef, it's the product, right. everything that's in there, that's it, done, simple. I know, okay, I know. <laughs> I know. I'm gonna make another one for you okay, too. I keep going. Go you for know, it. I know we're having fun with this, but the, the thing is, uh, it's it's the hot dog that all other hot dogs wish they were when they grew up. I mean, it really is because yes. it's 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 such a, a purest experience. And you, so you think you've tried a hot dog, not unless you've had you know a fat one. Mm -hmm. I mean, seriously, because this, if you want the ha I mean, Steve, I'm sorry, you said the the half pound count, um, and this is what I'm talking. I'm just gonna grab one of these. Go right ahead. Again, <laughs> so you're getting these are. <laughs> a half pound a piece. Yes, but that's the people that don't even understand. They're like, oh my gosh, why? They're what's what, what's going on with that whole freaking thing? It's so big. They're a half pound a piece. The, yeah. And you get two of them, and of course, <laughs> uh, or of course you get the four pack, yep. in which case you get four of those four packs, so I think it's so interesting. Yep. You know, Joey, I have to say, I really have to hand it to you, because the thing is, you wouldn't you wouldn't have had to do this. I mean, it, it's it, because you've been so successful. No, in every yeah. Area of I mean, your life. for me, like I said, it's something that I always just grew up like being in Coney Island in New yeah. York City, born and raised. You know, always get the hot dogs on the on the boardwalk, and it's yeah. it's something for me that reminds me of my childhood. Yeah, and I want to bring that to people out there. I think that's so cool, and you know that's why I say you can you can taste the love. And right. No kidding, we have people on our set tonight. I don't even know if they work at HSN. You know, it's <laughs> like you smell the hot dogs, and I'm like, oh, I'm coming. I'm coming. <laughs> you know, everybody has been raving about this, Joey. And the thing is, we have professional chefs. Mm -hmm. We have Wolfgang Puck. You know, you name it. Curtis Stone. Every, you know, all the great chefs here at HSN. People are growing bananas over these hot dogs. I love it. And I think it's because... With, like you said, there's no repeating. Nope. There's no mystery meat. Nope. It's a purest experience. That, I, I, I kind of tongue-in-cheek say it gets you closer to God, but it really <laughs> is kind of a heaven-sent experience. It's a hot dog that you don't have to feel bad about. Correct. You know? The thing about it is, like I said, one of the things I love about this is the mm. creations are endless. Oh, but yeah. I said what I really want and I really want to have is a great tasting okay. hot dog. That's something that that I always wanted it to stand for something. And, and, and I think naming it Fat Ones 
says it for itself. Now over here I have one where I made, which is, uh, I love doing okay, this one. Get? This is the Cuban, okay? Oh. Basically we take, you know, you take the mustard, you got the Swiss cheese, you got the hamburger, I mean a hamburger, listen to me, hot dog, okay. and then you actually just press it in like a panini press. Oh, that's a really good so idea. So then you have it and it's like a little panini kind of thing, oh, but neat. it's it's a Cuban. Look at that, so you know, again, the only way <laughs> you're gonna get the fat one is if we go to your, I like that you're dancing. There's a story, yeah, that's my, that's my, that's my little spot right now. Yeah. And like, and that's the hard part, because people are always calling me up going, hey, Joey, where can I get the hot dog? And yeah. I'm like, Orlando. And they're like, well, I do not live in Orlando. I'm like, well, that's cool. Well, now you can actually go and order it and have it at home. Mm. So that's the beauty part about it. And that's why oh, I'm not man. able to get there and build so many fat ones I'm out there. So I want to do something, you. especially for HSN, of course, 40th. Again, it's almost it's almost over the 40th in a sense, but we're gonna keep on going. I, I Your mean, hot I love, dog is my jam. Is it a jam? Yep. Your hot dog is, is my jam. <laughs> Jamming to the hot dog. Jamming to the hot it's dog. It's so good. <laughs> okay, I just keep I'm just gonna keep making them for you. I though. know. I love so I love doing this. Thing. Uh, we have the final 700. I actually ordered mine uh, before I got on the air and. I obviously, I'm not only a fan of Joey's, but you know, I, I, I you know, I'm, I'm kind of a food snob. Right. And, but I love me a hot dog. But the problem is, I don't eat hot dogs anymore, because it's kind of like I feel bad about my neck. I feel bad about my hot dog. Right. right. <laughs> you know, I feel bad about what's in my hot dog. Right. I feel bad about what's not in my hot dog. I feel bad about <laughs> the things I can't pronounce in my hot dog. <laughs> this is meat. It's a hundred percent beef. It's a hundred percent yeah. beef. And then again, that's what, what we. And I love about the whole thing is it's got mm. that little saltiness, but it's also got that sweet side to it. Oh, Oh, that's so what I love. You know what? I think it's the sweetness that's really, you know, kind of, you know, hitting it out of the park. Well, that's it. And it's so funny that people, because people really do pay attention to that. And, and that's the thing. We don't want to hide anything or say anything or go, no. oh, well, ours is way better. But it is the flavor profile of this hot dog. This is good. Literally, we sat down making it tedious, making good. it as far as, as much as we possibly can to what, you know, we kind of like and what we want to have. Yeah. And that's the beauty part about and it. And you know what? And there's nothing to feel bad about with this hot dog. I mean, it's meat-tastic. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's meat -tastic. <laughs> Fantastic. Can I use that, please? You can. I think I'm going to use that. It's, That's a, a, it's a meat of palooza. <laughs> Get on over here. I'll <laughs> no. flip these over for you. But you know, the other thing is, uh, as, as Joey is, is making these for us, you don't see a lot of shrinkage, you don't see a lot of waste, and that's because there aren't fillers. In Thank the hot you dogs. very much for saying that because yeah. that is actually true. That's something that I didn't get a chance to say. Where yeah. when you're getting a hot dog, sometimes you throw them on the grill, and all of a sudden they just go, Meh, and you go, What is I know. that? That's not what I bought. That's right? not, yeah, exactly. So when you're getting the eight mm. ounces from, you know, the actual eight ounces of the fat one, you're getting the eight ounces. When you're getting the 2.6, you're getting 2.6 ounces. I'm telling you, you've got to try these hot dogs. I'm serious about this. Because I'm kind of like a hot dog connoisseur. I, uh, that's, that's the best hot dog I've I am. Had. Thank you very much. That it's been pretty amazing because of the response had. that we've gotten from no, people. I'm and serious. I think people, they try to say, well, you know, or they try to blow smoke up my butt in a sense. <laughs> but the cool thing about it is I've had Guy Fieri come out and try it. Yep. I've had Donnie Wahlberg come out and try it. We've actually had the Practical Jokers come out and try them, though. Yeah. Just even people that are, you know, maybe not in the food industry. Right. And they love it, which is great. Well, when you first opened your restaurant, I mean, you are a destination resource. Now, you're not getting these hot dogs unless you're buying them here and tonight. Correct. This is, this is Joey's only scheduled appearance for the entire year so far. Yes. We're going to try to get him back here, but there are 600 of you who can get this. But when you first opened your doors, there was like a line. I mean. The line, it was, it was, you know, it was one of those things that was just so gratifying and exciting, but also nerve-wracking because I didn't yeah. know what was going to happen. But when I went out there, there was a four-hour wait. A four-hour wait. four-hour wait. And I looked at people, I'm like, please, just go home and then right. come back. For There's a reason dogs. to wait. For hot dogs. For hot dogs. And they were like, no, we love it. We want to come back yeah. and we want to be here. And, and we've had a lot of people that have come and repeat over and over again to come back to the place. So like I said, since we only have it in Orlando, we're not branching out yet. We yeah. hopefully like to, but we have it here for you right now. You know, this is kind of like couture hot dogs in a way. I mean, it really is. I mean, you've, yep. you've never had a hot dog like this. I mean, you just haven't. And, you know, promise me you'll at least try them because uh, this is the last shot at the birthday price. We raised the price. Mm -hmm. well, we're going to try to get Joey back this year. We just don't know if it's going to happen or not. What are you doing to I'd this love lovely to. thing? Uh, this is actually the New York. Very simple. Okay. You get the, uh, the sweet little red onions you can get at any store. Okay. You get the sauerkraut. And of course, you get a little bit of the mustard. Nothing too I crazy. I love sauerkraut. Very, very simple. Very, yeah. very simple. But you know, that's what's so great. You can enjoy it from a purist standpoint. You can dress it up. You can dress it down. It's like the little black dress of hot dogs. And like I said, yeah. And then you do a little zigzag. But I said, yeah. the beauty part about that is, is then when you're able to lift it up, it doesn't really kind of fall out all the way when you have that because it actually closes it and nestles it oh, in there. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Look it's my little you. trick that what we do. I mean, you guys can do it at home, of course. When you get the package, just butterfly it. Simple like Aren't that. you fancy? That's right. All right. That's well, right. if you want, if you want the, okay, 150 only. <laughs> 
and hot dogs and hot dogs. What? You don't Good like dance? Good Joey. Good Joey. Good Joey. All right. 150 <laughs> only. 150 only. Uh, remember, these are the half pound dogs and you get two of those. Again, look at the size. Yeah. It literally is, like no joke, the size <laughs> of my forearm and I'm not a small guy. So when people go, oh my gosh, is that really expensive? But look at the size that you're yeah. getting if you actually no do doubt. get the fat one. I know, it's, that's crazy. It's literally almost, it, it, it's, it's actually probably two or three of these. It is. You, it's get, you get a four pack, so you get four packs if you do, you know, yep. the traditional size, but those are still super sized. Yes. And then you get the two pack if you do the Meetapalooza. Yes. Shall we come back soon? We love, love you. To. Thank All you. Right. Appreciate it. Good to see you. All right. Keep calling your fat one. We're back in a minute. Yay, fat one! <laughs> Our 40th birthday party is almost over. Don't miss out on birthday pricing today and tomorrow only. And check out our birthday bestsellers at noon on hsn.com. All your favorite items at their best prices ever. Plus, tomorrow's the last day to get up to $40 off when you're approved for the HSN card. Tune in tomorrow as we celebrate the birthday finale on the Monday Night Show. Search 40 days now on hsn.com. I grew up always dreaming and wanting to create things. I see something and I see that we can make it better. One day, the light bulb just went off. Nobody has this. They're waiting for me to invent it. Next thing you know, you're on HSN and the whole world's hearing about it. It just sold out. <laughs> Very excited for oh you. HSN celebrates the dreamers, inventors, and entrepreneurs who follow their hearts, helping American dreams come true. Being here today proves anything is possible. Cheers to 40 years. We're toasting 40 days of birthday with up to $40 off when you get an HSN card. Celebrate with extra flex on all jewelry, beauty, and fashion. Plus VIP financing, VIP easy returns, and exclusive offers, all with no annual fee. Join the party of the year. Apply for your HSN card now. Call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com. We are 40. And the fun has just begun. Happy 40th. Happy 40th, HSN. Mwah. Look who's the big four. Oh, yeah. And not a day of over fabulous. So come party with us. This is our biggest party ever. We're celebrating 40 days of fun. With new surprises. Every day. Mega deals. Big brands. And super-sized names. And more reasons to shop HSN. Happy birthday. Cheers. All the birthday fun yet to come. You're looking good for 40. And at midnight, we are closing up our big 40th birthday. What does that mean? Well, we have one really huge today special coming up. All the great birthday pricing ends, all the awesome offers, but we still got one more day to celebrate. And we're gonna kick off this last and final day with an awesome, awesome item. We literally launched this back in May, sold out every single one we had, and it was so wildly successful. We said, hey, you know what? Let's end birthday month with a big today special, and that's what's coming up. So here's what I love. There's a customer that reviewed this, and really I thought some it up brilliantly. She said that the Nutribullet veggie machine is awesome for food prep, cuts your time down to nothing, and inspires your creative side to do more. Find out how and find out why. It's all coming up at midnight. The best offer anywhere. You're going to love it and you'll love what this is going to do. So stay with us. Shannon? Hey, thank you, Suzanne. Why didn't you have this earlier? I bought that off the infomercial. You know that, right? I did. I swear to you. I told Jenny Bond all about it. You, you can't get Lou on the infomercial. And, no. <laughs> and, and you normally, can't. you don't get him with this, but Tracy had a birthday. So That's right. we gave her time off for good behavior. Uh, and this is, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But this, Lou, I got to tell you, we, yeah. were we were talking during the break. I, first of all, I love this item. And boy, it's a heck of a deal. Is this a set of two for yes. this price? Yeah. And not only is it a set of two, but this is the only origami item that comes with inserts for it okay so you actually oh, get shelf liners yeah. this is the, ver the version of shelf liners that go with this particular one these are s nice solid wood listen yeah. to this sounds like a door you get four of these and you can put that we get four with each 
Let me put it that put it that right. way. So, and you can put them either, you know, do one shelf with yeah. these side by side, or you can do what I was doing as alternating shelves. Yeah. So it gives it a really neat look if you're gonna use these in the kitchen. Do you know what, I, I need these for my kitchen. These so obviously so cool. we've got the white. It's yes. kind of like buy one, get one. Yep. We've got black. Remember, it's like buy one, get one. I think, do we call this blush in the system? That is the blush. Okay, yep. blush. It's That's like the blush. buy one, get right one. Here in the middle. And then, uh, or I guess, sorry, I guess we're calling it pink in the pink system now. today. Okay. All right, turquoise. Uh, uh, that is the turquoise. Turquoise. Red. And the red. And, and then the vintage bronze. Oh, the vintage bronze. Vintage bronze. Now, one of our favorites. Let's show everybody what these are all about because these pantry racks, and by the way, we say pantry rack, you can honestly use them anywhere you want in the right, house, okay? Absolutely. Powder coated steel, you can hear that right there. You get the inserts with this. I'm gonna take these guys out because I wanna show you, since you know that it's origami, that means that it's going to come to your home fully assembled. Yeah. So you're not gonna have to really do anything to put this together. So watch what I'm gonna do here. Okay. And we all know how. How this works it comes flat packed like this in a box so you get two oh, of them oh yep. check that you're out you're getting two of them now if i turn this around and i grab the sides and i pull just like this it falls open there's that world famous origami toggle right there you thread that through you push down as soon as i do that the whole rack is already solid nice yeah. gonna lift the top over like this Ta -da. put the little latch in and we're done now this has, like so many origami products, yeah. the wheels on, wheels off thing. Right. Okay, so right. if you put the wheels on this, then we recommend you limit yourself to 20 pounds per shelf. Right. If you take the wheels off of this, okay. then you can put 30 pounds on each oh, shelf. Oh, nice. So it's either a 100 pound weight capacity, for, you know, total, or 150 pounds. Now, one more thing that I want to show you that's okay. really kind of cool, and this is one of my favorite things. Going to grab a can here. Look what we did to the, sh to the shelves on this. Oh, yeah. They have a lip on them. They're actually inverted. So oh, if you, if so you do smart. if you do put stuff on top here, you know, vegetables, right. cans of soda, you know, uh, cans of food like right. this, you know, it's not going to roll off of it. So that's just one of the little concessions we made it, it to is. the whole kitchen thing. With but this. you know what? Like, like Lou said, the, the pantry is just really kind of, you know, scratching the surface in terms of yeah. where you're going to put this. Like my girlfriend, uh, Renee, she rents a chair in a hair salon. But, mm -hmm. you know, then she has, you know, hair products that she sure. sells as well. So whether you use this in retail, hair salon, business, I mean, any kind of storage. In my powder bath, I've got one of those pedestal sinks, but yep. guess what? You can't hide your toilet paper. No, no place to put <laughs> nothing. A, there's no, no place to put nothing. Yep. And this is that perfect size, because it's got a nice profile to it, but it's not so wide. Yes. So if you do have a powder bath or a smaller area, or even a dormitory, a baby's oh, room, I mean, yeah. this is perfect. Assisted living. I mean, this is 10 linear feet of storage, okay? Because each right. shelf is two feet um, across. Okay. And it's about 11 inches deep. Right. So you're getting 10 linear feet of storage on this. So if you think about it, when you buy this set today, that's 20 feet of uh, yeah. linear storage that you're, you're right. getting there. And in a very small footprint. And that's the thing about origami that's so uh, crazy is that in just two feet of space, you're getting 10 feet yeah. of linear storage because of the way we stack these shelves. So you're getting a lot of these. Now I want to show you, speaking of the capacity of okay. these, okay, what these can hold. We Which know by the way, way, I just have to stress again, I was actually looking for the item number for the, the wooden shelves. You oh, know yeah. that, right? Yeah. I, but it comes it's, with your purchase. It comes with. So comes you're getting with four your purchase. with each with each one of these racks, you're getting four of these. So that's eight total that you're going to get that's when crazy. you buy these. It is, because normally it's something you have to buy in addition to. Now, Look at this one right here. Yeah. Okay, there oh, are 24 good. cans on top of this guy right oh, here. Holy cow. And look at all the stuff that's on here. Now, yeah. I want you to see something. Everything that you see that's on this rack right now yeah. is what's on the table behind oh. me. Yeah, so look, now, when you see it on the table, this looks like a ton of stuff, and you know what? It is. It is a ton of it stuff. It is a ton of stuff. Yeah. But when you see it on the rack right there, all of a sudden, yeah. think about this, after that last trip to the supermarket, that last trip to the big box stores, you're like, where in the world? I got a great deal. Yeah. You know, you extreme couponed yourself to death on this, okay, exactly. but where's all this stuff gonna go? Right here. I gotta be honest though, we could have put more on there if we wanted. Oh yeah. I mean seriously. You know what? I'm gonna turn this sideways just yeah, so people can see, see this. Because see there's room behind here. I want you I to mean, look. We didn't crowd that third shelf, that no. fourth shelf at all. Right. I mean look at all the extra room you still have. And do you know why there's still room on yeah. there? Because we ran out of room on the table. Oh. <gasps> see, we, we, we do a one for one here. So it's like we ran out of room on this You're four right. foot table, okay? So we didn't put, you know, what's here is here. So right. that's it. it so we could have put more on yeah. there. Yeah, if we had I a bigger mean, table, we could have put more. You really could. But if you shop for your appliances, you know, I, I really do love to cook. Uh, that's why it's always so fun for me to do cooking shows here at HSN. But the big problem for me is, okay, where do I put that rice cooker? Where do I put that right. wrap master? Where do I put my toaster and my coffee maker and all this stuff? Because you're not using everything all the time, no. for crying out loud. Nope. This would be great, even if you just use it for a 
appliance storage. Yeah, I, I, and more and more people are doing that too because I think yeah. we're kind of getting to the point now. We love these things, they make our lives much easier, yeah. more convenient, for sure. more fun to cook, but where do we put them, you yep. know? Because like I, we redid our kitchen a couple of years ago. We actually had something built into our kitchen called an appliance garage. Have you seen one of these? I haven't. It's a really cool thing. It's got like a, like a roll top on it, right? And you put your appliances in it and you close it. The thing is it only fit like two, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's, not, it's not a lot. So you get one food processor in there, you're pretty much done. So what's your option? Well, you want to leave things out. And this right. is a nice way to do it. it so is. everything's right there. I know, can you, I have to point out though, it's it's kind of like the perfect marriage between functional and fashion. Yeah. Because this is really pretty. Really pretty. I, you know, just so it almost has like a little lattice in the back of that one shelf. Yep. And then you add those wooden, wooden shelves that come with the product, which I think is, is it amazing. It adds something to it, doesn't it? It does add something yeah. to it. So whether we're talking dormitory, you name it. Yeah, well notice the black one. If you buy the black, it actually comes with black uh, shelf oh, inserts. Oh, good point. So yeah. they're, they're black lacquered, okay? And then the rest of them are, are the natural wood looking. But I mean, look, at this. I mean, for a pantry, a it's awesome. I'm going to yeah. tell you that straight up. It is fantastic for a pantry. But you don't have to use it in the pantry. As you were saying, you know, the bathroom, it's yep. wonderful for it that. Is. You know, if you don't have a linen closet, you could use it in there. Um, you know, there's no reason why, if you're one of the people that moved in, why, somebody was telling me this morning or yesterday, yeah. they moved into a brand new house and they walked into the closet and they thought, wow, this has so much room. And then they realized <laughs> it has a lot of room because there's no, no shelves in it. Yeah. There's nothing in it. So this is a great way to add shelves to a closet like that. You know what I mean? And that's happening a lot. I mean, yes. you know, so the crazy thing is it's wherever you have storage or storage needs. And I, I, it is the marriage between fashion and function together. So we'll give you, uh, kind of get your creative juices flowing here. Remember, this is your final airing at birthday price. We're doing that free shipping. The flex pay is done, I think after this show. Mm -hmm. I mean, and look at all the different storage options you got going on here. Well, and the turquoise is gorgeous, too. I mean, this is a great color, especially, you know, for a kitchen, this is fun. But again, if you want to put out your fruit on here, your spices, yeah. you know, mixing bowls, anything like that, this is a really nice way to do it. And it looks so wonderful in the kitchen. I mean, it, it, does. it really, it doesn't look like, you know, you went and bought like a particle board bookshelf uh, right. and threw it in the kitchen. No. Uh, you know, yeah, who's going to do that? Yeah, it doesn't look there? industrial either. Exactly. You know? No, it doesn't. It looks like it belongs there, yeah. okay? The guy behind me, here, take a look at this one. Again, more of our kitchen utensils yep. and essentials that we have put out here like this. I love with the red on this, too. This is a really cool color. It is. Uh, it really pops. It almost looks like a store. It kind doesn't of does, it? doesn't it? I mean, it looks like I could shop right from it. Funny you should say that, yeah. because a lot of people will use their origami products if they have, like, a, a flea market booth oh, yeah. or for craft shows or if they just have a regular store and they need fixtures. Right. Our stuff is great for that, too. Look at this one right here. This is that vintage bronze color. And this one, to me, is it's like an espresso brown. Um, and I love it because it's got a little flex of gold in yeah, it. It's a real, it's it's a real very pretty one. Rich and if looking. you look at the wood on this one, if I could, let me see if I can grab one of these inserts. Because the inserts on this one, they're all, this one is just a slightly different color oh, yeah. than the one that's on the white. The one on the white is more like an oak. Yeah. Here, let's show everybody. Okay. See, Good the point. one on, yeah, see what I mean? So if you get the white, you're gonna get this color. It's more like an oak. And if yep. you get the uh, the red, the turquoise, or the vintage bronze right here, you're gonna get this color here, which is more like a, um, I don't know, what would you say that is? Walnut. Walnut, I was gonna Thank say you. A, a That walnut. was what I was looking for. I was yeah. grasping for it, couldn't get it. Walnut, right there. Absolutely. So, and again, you hear that solid wood solid on that. Solid wood. Included, so, you uh, get them. Uh, Steve, I think you said the turquoise is almost gone. Yes, no, maybe? Okay, the turquoise is almost gone, and then uh, was it the pink that is also? Okay, and the pink will be right after that, followed by the black. But the other great thing about this is no assembly required. Yeah, let me show that yeah. again, because okay, I'm, gonna gra I'm gonna grab this guy right here. And, you know, and the wood inserts just pop right out, and you can use them in any one of the shelves. I just like putting them side by side like this. But you could, you know, if you want to, you can stagger them like that, you know? Yeah. One down there, one up here, it's up to you, whatever you wanna do. Uh, with origami, you're only limited by your imagination. Yeah, you get to really use true. it any, once you buy it, you get to use it any <laughs> way you want. That's exactly right. That's the joy of it, okay? okay? So watch this, though. So here's how it's gonna come to your house. Now, look what she's doing. She's got a big, uh, slow cooker on there yeah. in the laundry room. Oh, perfect you know, for the laundry people room. People never have a lot of yeah. space in the laundry room. The, the, the small footprint on this is great. Yeah. And that right there, we were just talking about that in the restroom. It's I, yeah, I know. Too. Seriously, if you've got a pedestal sink like I do, oh, yeah. I mean, I mean, they're they're pretty, but you know, where are you gonna put all your stuff? Yeah. So before we go to the phones, though, this okay. is the footprint. Yeah. So you, you can use it, you know, retail, flea market, oh, sure. store. It travels I mean, very well. It does. And it's made to be open and closed. Absolutely. Well, Alice in Florida is a fan of origami. Alice, it's Lou and Shannon. Welcome to HSN. Thank you. So Alice, we hear you love your origami. 
Oh, I have 20 plus pieces of origami <gasps> over the last several years. Nice. And I made a move from Colorado to Florida two years ago, and it was great to move. Yeah. Um, I use them everywhere. Absolutely. Hey, Alice, are they as easy to put together as we say <laughs> they are? <laughs> Just as easy. <laughs> I know. It's, it, we always kind of joke. We say it's actually harder to get it out of the box than yeah. it is to put it together, right? That is true. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, they're very easy to handle. They're so sturdy. Yeah, for it's sure. It's amazing. Well, Alice, nice to have you along. Thank you so much Thanks, for Alice. sharing the good word. Take care, Alice. Oh, great product. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Bye -bye. Uh, and, you know, that's what's so interesting. I, Alice said she's got, like, 20 of these. And yeah. we hear that consistently from every caller. They're like potato chips you don't have one origami you end up with yeah. a whole family of origami yeah and this is something that it's it's unlike anything else in the origami family i think oh it's because different. it's decorative but it's also functional no at the same it time. really oh and remember see but it does share, uh, share certain traits with the rest of the origami family yes it is that powder coated steel so yep. you could use these outdoors if you wanted for plant shells if yes. you wanted to use this for drying things you know yeah. anything like, even herb gardens and watering yep. things right on it you know all of that applies absolutely well uh nancy in louisiana got Got it. Hi, Nancy. Well, Nancy, it's nice to have you uh, along. What made you select our set of two shelves tonight? Because of the smaller ones, and it comes in this excellent value pack. Yep. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to use it in my uh, laundry room. Yes. And oh, in my kitchen for the, my appliances, my Wolfgang Puck appliances and all those. Um, and also, there's I have the kitchen carts and all the other storage shelves, but the kitchen carts are wonderful to use, like from uh, put medications and yeah. keep it right by my bedside and everything. So I just love origami. They're great. Absolutely. Well, Nancy, I'm so glad you got this two pack before it sells out. Thank you so yes, much I got for the turquoise. Oh, good. And I wanted to say about the origami products that they're so easy to take when you split the box. They're so easy to take out. Yeah. And I have arthritis really bad in my hands. Yeah. And back and neck problems. I have no problems putting these up. And I'll get me take them out of the box, and there they are. Oh, oh that's great. well, Nancy, thank you. We so appreciate you for sharing the good word. Take good care and enjoy the rest of your night, okay? Well, thank you very much. Thank You're you, welcome. Nancy. Thank you. But you know, I, uh, the case in point, she yeah. said that she's got you know you know pretty severe arthritis in her hands. Now, if something had a bunch, bunch of pieces and parts and screws and widgets oh. and things like that, there's no way that Nancy could put that together. No. And, you know, you're, you're only limited to your own imagination in terms of how and where you're going to use this. And don't let that price fool you. The thing is, Lou, that's why I always like to show us, you know, kind of overstocking these. Yeah. Because you really, you can really load these things up. <gasps> yeah, I mean, and, and again, if you look at this, you go like, well, it's kind of on the small side. Look at everything on the yeah. table right here, and that's exactly exactly what's on the pink one next yep. to Shannon right there. Everything on this table is what's on there right now, and we amazing. actually have room to put more. Yeah. The top shelf alone has got 24 cans on oh, it. Wow. So, I mean, you could put all your sodas up you there. Could. You put all your vegetables, you know. If you if you can yourself, you can you use it for that. I mean, so yep. many things you can yeah. do with these. Well, and I love what Nancy said, too. She's like, she's going to put one in her laundry yes. room and one to store all of her Wolfgang Puck All her Wolfgang Puck, yes. That's fantastic. But, you know, that's just it, because, Nancy, I'm like you. I, I, I swear I feel like I have every appliance that we, we sell here at HSN, but you can't use everything all the time. No. You know what I mean? Yeah. And then it's like, where do I put all that stuff? Well, and it's nice if you can see everything. So it's you remember sure. once in a while, you know what? I do have one of those. <laughs> that's I mean, exactly that's, that's gonna, right. And remember, you're getting two. Yeah. Well, I, I haven't said that in a while. You're getting two. Two. I mean, it's, two. it's really like a buy one, get one. That's one yeah. of the other things that Nancy said, too. When we do these value packs, people go bananas mm -hmm. because then it's almost like a half price sale because you're getting the free shipping. You're yeah. getting it for less than you would spend if you're getting for one. Uh, black is very limited. The pink is very limited. And the turquoise that Nancy got is also very limited. I can't believe you get those shelves. And you, get, and you get the little shelf inserts yeah. as well. Real wood. That's nice. Listen to that. Yeah. But you know, and like you said too, Lou, it still shares that characteristics of that uh, powder coated steel the as well. The strength as well. The strength. 100, 100 pound total with the wheels on it. 150 pounds without yeah. the wheels. I know. So don't Pretty let nice. the size or the price fool you. No. You you can do everything from the extra toilet paper to the canned soup to your appliances to your beauty products to you know put it in your powder bath put it in your vanity or as your vanity put it in your laundry room put it in your kitchen and i love that little and lip. the cans of soda will never be yep. rolling across See, the I floor think that again is so smart Isn't that neat? and you know and you can
can really see too, the shelves don't bow, they don't oh, no. bend. I love your All idea steel. of putting it outside though too, if yeah. you've got seedlings well, you or know, plants. And you know, you don't want to have Water's to worry about drain rusting. through right, right. here. Yeah. Absolutely. Baker's racks, so, so many things. It's a smart purchase, it's a two for one. This is your final opportunity. Yeah. So we're in the last few moments of birthday. So remember everything does expire within the next 24 hours and this is only as long as supplies last. It's been a long time since I've seen us do a value pack on this because yeah. when I got mine, I had to buy one individually. I mean, so the fact that you're getting the two pack tonight is a big, big deal. Well, Lou, thanks for pinch you're hitting for Tracy. Welcome. My pleasure. Nice to have you here. Uh, you back for the last day of birthday or is this it? No, no. This is, okay. Oh, no, I got one show tomorrow night. Oh, one show tomorrow, one show tomorrow night. Tomorrow All right. Yeah. Lou, thank you as you're welcome, always. My pleasure. Suzanne is up next with the Veggie Bullet. I will be back on Wednesday night at midnight with a brand new Today's Special. Speaking of which, I think I might stick around. Now that I've had hot dogs, I need some healthy oh. stuff too. Here she is. Well, I have to tell you, I'm pretty darn excited to be wrapping up our huge 40th birthday. Thank you so much for being a part of it. Tonight, we're going to take you through a culinary experience and one that's going to make your life in the kitchen so much easier, so much more convenient. We'll even save you money some later on. But right now, we're going to feature our very best value of the day. I think a customer summed this up beautifully when she talked about the Nutribullet veggie machine. She said, you know what? It has allowed me to be so much more creative in the kitchen. And you're going to eat healthier because of this brilliant invention. We're going to jump into it right now, so let's get busy. It is our very best value of the day, and remember, all of our birthday pricing, all these special deals, well, they all end in the next 24 hours. Here's the last and final today's special. I normally don't start right off the bat with a customer review, but this one was so good I had to. And this customer, she sums it up so beautifully. She says, awesome for food prep, cuts your time down to nothing, and inspires your creative side to do more. Well, tonight you're gonna find out how